All right, guys, I've been working on a new little project here. Um, we're always talking about taking a saw or something with us backpacking, but as most of you know, I don't like to carry anything that weighs very much. Um, so I did a little bit of research, come up with a, with an idea, and uh, here's what I got. Basically, it is a bow saw blade from the old regular bow saw that you buy at the hardware store. This is actually one that I took off my bow saw out of the shop. Um, this is a 21 inch. I'm doing a little research. They make 21 and uh, we're up to 30 inches. I think the 24 inch is probably the most popular size. Uh, and I'll mess with different sizes. This is just one that I had laying around. It's a 21 inch does fit into my backpack fairly well like this uh, these are just some binder clips here and then I use some key rings split key rings on the ends here great to hold it by uh, but they also have another use this whole little setup right here weighs two ounces and uh, of course you're probably thinking well what what good does really this do you could cut something with it I guess like that but uh, we're going to make a bow saw, and I've already done a little bit of work. Uh, we just basically went out and found a piece of hardwood, uh, sapling, limb here. As you can see, I cut it a little bit longer than, than the blade itself. This one already had a little natural bow into it. I'm still playing with it, uh, trying to figure out what size, but this one seems to work pretty good, I think. Uh, so I'm going to take my leatherman here just going to notch it out on the ends you can see here what it is I'm going to do the same thing here on this end by notching that out that's going to give me something to mess with throw that out Got a good natural spring to it. And now, put it in here. Grab that ring. Put it in here. Pull tight. And I got a homemade butt saw. That I don't have to carry the frame for. Um, I've used it. Works pretty good, to be honest with you. Uh, at two ounces, I don't know that it's something that I'd always want to carry. But on a on a winter trip where I know that I want to keep a good supply of firewood, or a canoe trip where I would, you know do something like that, definitely be uh, going with me on several trips. I think, and I do like it. Cost about three bucks, four bucks online for replacement blades. Um, the high, high quality ones you can get for about ten to fifteen bucks. And I'll probably order a few of those, mess with different links and whatnot. But this twenty-one inch does seem to work pretty good, um, and I'm happy with it. Here's a uh, little piece of wood that I'm going to demonstrate how it works. Nice clean cut. Old dull blade. Cheap. Inexpensive. And packs down to next to nothing.
Once again, this one didn't actually cost me anything. It was an old blade that I had laying around. Some old binder clips. Of course, split key ring. Two ounces. Nice little saw. Definitely can see it going with me on several trips. Anyhow, thanks for watching. Have a great day.